Welcome to the Fox One Corp series of training videos. I'm Dave Springford. In this video, I want to take a look at how you can create a new profile from scratch using LX Styler. Instead of taking a current profile that may or may not have errors, if you just want to start over, we can do that with a fresh profile. So to do that, the first thing we do is we go up to this icon for new. Click on that and select your device. In this case, LX9000 in portrait mode, and we'll double click. We now have a completely new profile. One of the problems that occurs when we have a new profile is that when we go into tools and we go into settings editor, we do not have access to all the settings that we would otherwise have access to on the device or in SIM. So a quick workaround that we can use is we can take this profile, save it, put it onto SIM, load it, make it active, save it, and bring it back into Styler. So let's go ahead and do that. Go here to File, and we'll do a save. And what I want to do is I want to save it to, on my desktop, I have LX SIM, and I have my LX SIM SD card. And I want to save to that SD card. So we are going to save this as a video sample profile onto the SD card. And if we scroll down the list, we'll now see that video sample profile with today's date, and we can load that. So I'm going to load, and now it's on the internal memory of the device. I need to make it active. Now that it's active, if I click Save, and I put it back on the SD card, and overwrite, we can go into Styler. And in Styler, we now need to reload that profile. So we're going to open from the LX Sim SD card that video sample profile that we've just saved from Sim. We've reloaded that. And now when we go to Tools, and Settings Editor, we have access to all of the data. This came up in a particular conversation at one point with a customer who was asking me about how can you get access to the units. And I've had that problem in the past where I've saved a profile, put it on my machine, and all the units were wrong. So by doing this, saving it in SIM, taking it back into Styler, we can now go into Styler and we can double click on any of these and set whatever units we want. We can set everything in here that we could set on the device or on uh, SIM. Another question that came up was about the units. There's also under Glider Presets, if we go to Options, we can see some units in here. These units are used only in the aircraft. The aircraft that is stored is no longer stored within the profile. In the past, all the aircraft parameters were stored within the profile. Now they're stored separately to a maximum of three aircraft on the device. These units now refer to all the aircraft speeds that you can set up. For example, if you're doing a flap tape, or they apply to weight and balance. That's why we have this CG input mode. They apply to polar, if you're doing vertical speed, load, those items. So all the units in here apply only to the aircraft, not to what you display on the screen when you're flying. The units that are on the screen that you fly with come from under Settings Editor down here in the Units menu. So hopefully you've learned something new about your LX computer today. Please visit me online at www.fox1corp.com.